G'day Reptile fans, Troy K here. You remember a couple of weeks back I brought you an uh, episode from Rally of Magic with Wayne Larks with a little nine green lace monitor that hatched out at day 161. It was a, uh, it was a little premi lacy, absolutely gorgeous thing. If you haven't seen it, go back, give that a watch. Anyway, I'm back at Rally of Magic with Wayne and we've got, uh, we've got a second one that's hatched out and then a third and the fourth that have just sort of pipped. So I thought, you know, do an update on the first one while we're over here and, you know, see if that little bug is put on any weight. I've, I've heard from Wayne that he is eating quite frequently every second day, so that's a good sign. Um, so, yeah, we'll check in on that little bugger and check out, you know, check out these new ones. All right, man, so we got the little first one. Yeah. Have you named this little bugger yet or not yet? No, I haven't given it a name yet. Haven't given it a name yet? No. Now, how often is this thing this thing feeding for you? Um, every second day. And what are you feeding it? What sort of mints? Is it kangaroo uh, mints? It's, or it's just getting um, mice. Mice? Sl slithers of mice. Of oh, mice. Really? Just smashing them down? Yeah, I've got to give them little bits. Only little bits of it at a time. Yep. It's about three bits down and then that's it. <laughs> Let's see if we can see this. Let's take it there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There he is. Alright, so you guys remember that one. He was mm. hatched out at day 161 yeah. and he was only nine greens. So the moment of truth. You want to tear oh, that? I want to tear that, yeah. <laughs> Don't want it long this, to us. This thing jumps. Uh, I won't be touching it. So here we go. Moment of truth. See how, see how long this little fella's yeah, going. Mate. Here we go. Oh. Let's have a look. Right, so I'm seeing 13 grams, is that yeah, right? 13 grams. Alright, so he's put on 4 grams. Yeah. No, oh, that's amazing. So, if you guys, for those that seen the first video, you'd remember Wayne um, offered this guy a little bit of mince straight uh, day one. Yeah. And it hatched out and he fed and drank day one. And we, yeah, we got to capture it all on film. That's cool. Look so, how light he is. Now you were saying that um, the difference between him, <coughs> excuse me, and the next one is you can actually see the other one's got a few more colours coming through Sorry. than this little yeah. bugger. Yep. And that's cool because they say the colourations in the last three weeks, that's when they start really colouring up. So yeah. you want to get the next one out? We'll do a, do a we'll, weight difference. We'll, we'll do. Alrighty. Uh, I'll watch you get this. I'll watch you put this guy back. <laughs> Uh, reptile fiends love him. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So gentle at the top there. Look at that. Did we go too far, mate? Yeah, you're gonna have to get him, Troy. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, here we go. Coming down the other arm. I mean, <laughs> we've got a good shot of your tattoos there, man. <laughs> oh, awesome. <laughs> oh, good to see him active. Very, very active, eh? Oh, good stuff. Alrighty, out come the next ones. Hey, okay, next one. It's gonna... Is this a little bit bigger? Now, what day did this hatch out? What's what's the incubation date? Um, one eighty something. Deb said four. Well, one eight six. One eight six. That was it. One eight six. So the first one was one hundred and sixty one. This one was one hundred and eighty six. So an extra twenty five days. Yep. Still at thirty one and a half degrees. Yep. Same temperature all the way. Alrighty, let's have a look. Uh, wow. See the extra colours? You can, you can see all that peachy through it. Yeah. 
and you can definitely see the size difference. Now, how old is this thing? One, two days old? Um, just hatched yesterday. So there you go. Let's get this thing in there. Uh, right, let's get it on the scales. Yeah. We just have to be careful because he might jump out of the tub. Ah. Uh, with the big boy. Sounds alright. Yeah. 32 because 33 is today. Hey, it's our piece. <laughs> <laughs> still, it shows you the um, triple the size. Yeah. Of the little fella, safe to say, when the little fella was hatched. Yeah extra 25 days so a bit over three weeks nearly four weeks difference you can see how much difference at them staying in that egg for the extra month soaking up that yolk does yeah and then the yeah. colors like wayne said yeah. uh, try and get a comparison the yellow on his legs and then the peach all down the back Fellas coming Come back out. I'll try and do a side by side for you folks. Yeah, just with the colour even. Yeah, look at the difference. So there you go, the little fella. They are hatched out at day 161. Yeah. And this one here hatched out at day 186. Yeah, we're getting back. <laughs> <laughs> You're a little fan favourite, you are. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. He's a keeper. The little fella? Yeah. Uh, we'll have to get a name, I just love a name. Even the ye yellow is a bit dull over there. Yeah. Yeah, it's a very dull yellow compared to, this is a very vibrant yellow on, mm. the, on the legs, a couple of centre spots. You know, very yellow. He does a little work up there, eh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love these things. Now, for those that haven't seen the first episode, how about we slip up the back and we check out Mum and Dad, for yeah. those that haven't seen it before. Always, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. So we're up at the pits, just got to the first pit and seen a big, uh, big print here. So I thought we'd stop here and have a, have a quick geezer at this big fella. Have a go at him. Hey, what a monster. Alright. Right back in lane. It's a purely sort of a day here, as, um, as you know, we're in sunny Queensland, but it's winter, and um, yeah, we're not getting uh, warm days. Yeah. Alright, so this is their pit, they got a nice little home in there, but they're tucked away hiding at the moment. So Wayne's going to go in, he's going to see if he can chase him out somehow, but while he's doing that. <laughs> Lucky for us, he's got a few monitors to look at. So there's another Bell's phase. So this pit's amazing for those, oh here we go, no, I'm in the shadow, get me out of the shadow. You can see another big fella tucked away in there. Where's his head? There he is. Yeah, yeah, he is poking his head up. Got another. Oh, they're on the move now. Another one over there. Another one on the move in the back. 
So he's got a total of five in this pit. And so I'll stand back so you can come have a look at it. It's a kick-ass pit. There's plenty of plenty of room. Nice big tree for him. What'd you find, man? Nothing, mate. She's hiding. Oh, hiding? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. If you go back to... If you go back to the last clip with the nine green lace monitor, I'm pretty sure we had mum and dad, mum and dad in there for that one. Uh, so make sure you check that out. We'll probably head back in. Wayne was talking before about feeding... You're feeding that thing a slither of mice, is that right? Yeah. So for those that don't know what a slither of mouse is, we'll um we'll go through and do that, yeah? Yeah mate, yeah. Rightio, done. So before we go back I just noticed the uh they took feathers? Yep, they sure are. That was their last piece. <laughs> <laughs> What's the biggest food item you've thrown in there for these guys to tackle? Um, Have you ever thrown like a full rabbit in there to let them tear it apart or anything yeah, like that? Big full hair. Yeah. yeah. What's that like to watch? Oh, brutal. <laughs> they going would be. Yeah. A lot of laceration. Yeah? Yeah. I don't know if YouTube will allow anything like that. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I just... Oh, we have got videos up somewhere. Oh, probably on Morelia Magic. Gone. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so I just thought I'd... Yeah, just spotted that and thought, yeah, I'd just double check on that one. Whether they actually caught themselves a, a wild bin chook or something. <laughs> or, um... Because I know you got... I know you got, like, sunflower seeds and sorghum and stuff growing through the pits. Yeah. So I wonder if they were lucky enough to catch themselves a bird or whether you threw in a hey, defrosted chook for them. Yeah, no. Cool. Alright. This, this is how I've been um, feeding this little monitor. We're going we're gonna to do some slicing of mice. A mouse slither. Yeah, it's a frozen mouse. Yep, frozen mouse. So that thing's still frozen or it's defrosted? Frozen. Right. Yeah. Filleting knife. Yeah, filleting knife. Any sharp knife. Yeah. Just grab your mouse. Start for filleting. Because it's frozen, you can cut through everything. So nowhere no, near as messy as it sounds. No, that's right. That's all you need really, so. You see, you can say that's still frozen. Do you put the top half of the mouse back in the freezer? Yeah, I, I do, yeah. Yep. Yep. And then we just gotta wait for these to thaw out. And that'll last until we get to the freezer. Hey reptile fans, sorry we just um, we just had a little stuff up. I thought I was recording, we just had the little little guy go and take this bit of a slither of the mouse. And I realised I hadn't hit record yet. What an idiot I am. So anyway, that's what's happened. He's taking, a, he's taking the first slither. And yeah, we're about to jump back into it. Alright. He's taking it. And he's just a bit shy because we were here. <laughs> <laughs> you need a mason with him. Yeah. Yeah, and as I was saying before, like with a normal size monitor, you do the same thing, but with just bigger chunks of mice, you know, just chop it up so we can eat it. They should get into it straight away. Yeah, for those, um, yeah, sorry guys, this guy Wayne was um, just offered this a uh, little bit of mouse to it on. Uh, he was just holding it with the tweezers, and um, and you can see the see the slivers there. It's literally a slither a mouse it's like a fillet yeah. and um yeah just offered it that on the tweezers and wait when was, he was asleep Wayne woke him up he grabbed it and yeah we've been messing with him so he's a bit shy on a bit shy yeah. to eat it so we might leave him in peace and then yeah we'll come back and try for another bite shot try and make sure i hit record this time around <laughs> 
So, right, hey guys, uh, while we're waiting for the little nine gram one to have a feed, we thought we'd check these eggs out. And three, uh, three eggs to go, as you can see, one, two, three. One's got the red dot on the top, so you can tell top from bottom, because as we all know, we don't want to roll our reptile eggs. And uh, look at the slits in this one. So we can tell this is definitely a Bell's. Uh, Bell's face lace monitor coming through here yep. and if you go back to the episode with the nine you know the episode about the nine grand one being premmy you'll see mum and dad and that and you'll see that mum's a Bell's face and dad's a um, dad's a normal a normal uh, normal face lace monitor yep. so you got to be stoked with uh, with actually another little Bell so oh yeah, yeah you've got a yearling Bell stashed away next door yeah. So, uh, yep. Another. Marsh, yeah. Will this one be another keeper or will you be selling this one? Or? Uh, I wasn't going to keep any more, but I'll be keeping that little one, I reckon. Keeping the little premium one? Yeah. 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 All right, guys, so there you go. We just thought we'd show you while we're waiting on that other one to, yeah, to chew down his slither and moths, mouse. Just thought we'd show you some monitor eggs. Um, We've come back and. It's asleep. <laughs> oh, he's opening his eyes. But he's pretty, pretty much. Yeah, look at the belly, man. And I don't think he's left any. No. All right, so he's he's choked it down. No worries. Yeah. You want to try him with another one and see if we can get that bite shot? Oh, or is he is he done? You reckon oh, he's, he's pretty much asleep, man. All right, yo. Alright, sorry guys, we'll get the bite shot another time. I can't believe I've done that. <laughs> Absolute rookie, eh? <laughs> anyway, so there's the update on the on the little premi little premi lace monitor that hatched out at uh, 161 at nine grams. It's now pushing what we say, eleven grams. Eleven grams and, now, I think. And then we seen its brother or sister that hatched out at day uh, 186 at the proper weight of 32 grams. Yep. And you can actually see all the peach through the back where this one's still very yellow um, and lots a faint of, yellow. Lots of white along here too. Yeah, the other one was very, the yellow was vibrant yellow and the peach was, was a peachy peach. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for sharing that with us, Wayne. No worries at all, mate. And no doubt I'll be back in like another month or so and we'll do yeah. another check in with this little guy. Yep. See if it's got a name and see if it's put on any more weight. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> All right, cheers, man. See ya. Cheers.